Hey, I'm Roland with Mobile Geeks right here at the Lenovo Yoga Tablet 2 launch. And this is the new Tablet 2 Pro. So that's the new high-end 13-inch model. They're branching out, going above that 8 and 10-inch uh, form factor that they had before to this full-size, pretty much, 13-inch uh, form factor. And this is special because it doesn't only have an IPS panel running at a Quad HD resolution of 2560 by 14. 40 pixels. It also has an integrated mini projector. It has a Pico projector integrated right into the case, into that bulge that also includes uh, the battery right here. So you can actually just turn this on and have it project pretty much anything you like that's on the screen to your bedroom wall or whatever. Up to a distance of up to two meters and the size or the picture size on the wall is going to be uh, 50 inches. The resolution on the Beamer is only 720p, so they're uh, cutting that down uh, by four times pretty much because this is a Quad HD panel and what's output through there is actually just 7, uh, 720p, but that's definitely still decent because this whole thing comes in at just under 500 euros and it's fully equipped, as I said, Quad HD on here. Uh, what else is in there? We have an Intel Atom uh, Z3745 quad core, so that's running at 1.33 gigahertz, going up to 1.86 gigahertz uh, on Turbo Boost with its four cores. There's two gigs of RAM in here and 32 gigs of flash storage. Also, you also get um, two speakers down there next to the hinge that actually output eight watts of power, and there's also a subwoofer in integrated right here that I'm going to show you in a second. Um, as you're used to from all the other uh, Lenovo Yoga tablets, you can just fold down the stand right here and hold it with one hand. The whole thing weighs in at 950 grams, so that's pretty heavy actually. And you can fold out the stand to any angle that you pretty much like. You can uh, open it up by pressing this small button right here. So there's a button right there. And there you can actually see the JBL 5 watt subwoofer that they've integrated right here. So this should put out some decent bass that I can't really show you right now because the volume in this place is really, really high. Uh, there's an 8 megapixel camera right there. Underneath this flap, you also get this uh, smaller thing right here where you can insert a micro SD card slot for storage extension. And there's also a SIM card right here because this will also be available as an LTE model that has an Intel modem integrated uh, for speeds up to 150 megabits, I think. I'm just gonna leave that right there for now. Uh, let's take a quick tour around then. So we have the Pico projector right here. This is a button that turns on the uh, projection automatically. There's a mic right there. As I said, the speakers on the front there. And over here you have the on and off button integrated into the uh, bulge of the battery down here. This is your headset jack, micro USB port, plus a uh, volume rocker. There's no micro HDMI on this device, it seems. And the back is made out of plastic. It has this nice structure to it. Doesn't feel cheap at all. Uh, doesn't attract fingerprints because of this uh, matte kind of structure. And what I forgot to mention is actually there's a slider down here to adjust the sharpness on, uh, or the focus on the mini beamer that's integrated in this device. We are running Android 4.4.2 KitKat on here, and the Atom SoC actually seems to keep up quite nicely with the super high resolution on this device. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. What's also pretty nice is that they have integrated this quick settings menu, so they've moved it from the notification bar that's pretty much empty up here, down here into this uh, menu that you slide up from the bottom, and you get a whole bunch of settings in here for, uh, uh, screenshots and the Novo smart switching for external uh, displays, for example, volume, uh, this is the uh, brightness um, settings and all the other settings are pretty much readily available for you right here. But you can also turn on the projector right there and there you go. So this actually projects the screen contents onto pretty much any surface that you decide for it to uh, project to. I'm just going to try and get this to focus a bit right here and as you can see I can just pretty much let this project to pretty much anywhere that I want. So I was rolling with Mobile Geeks checking out the Lenovo Yoga Tablet 2 Pro 
at the launch event. And if you like what we do on our channel, give us a thumbs up. Follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. And we will see you later. Bye. Bye.